Hi, this is Nathan, your neighbor at Arcade and Pinball Talk On. Today we're going to be uh, going over the steps of installing game code on your Stern uh, pinball machines. Uh, first things you want to do is you want to go to sternpinball.com uh, and actually go to the Stern page, go under game code. And then, of course, under game code here, you're going to be going and selecting what game uh, you want to search. And, of course, for today, we're going to be updating our Ninja Turtles uh, Pro. So we will be going over the steps moving forward. Now, after searching for Ninja Turtles uh, under the search, uh, we've come across Ninja Turtles here, and we're going to go ahead and click on that. And, of course, at that point, that will bring us up to the selection of the game. So, of course, doing a Pro, uh, as you can see here, you have Ninja Turtles Pro 1.23 game code download file. Uh, and then, of course, you have a README. So, of course, the one that you want to do is the download file for the game code. And what we want to do is just, we want to click down load file here. And what that does, it will go into a download and a zip under your documents. You can also save it to your thumb drive uh, at this point. I, I generally will do it to my computer first. That way I could pull off from the computer and place directly on my thumb drive. The thumb drives that you want to get are generally eight to 16 uh, gigabyte. And uh, so this one's a 16. Uh, but other than that, let's go to our next step. So now that we've downloaded the Turtles Pro 1.23 code, uh, what we notice here is it will be a zip. And so in the documents that you see, it'll say Turtle Pro zip. What you want to do is you want to click on that and double click. And what happens is there's going to be two files that are opened up here. So as you can see, one of them is the major file 1.93 or 1.53. The other one's 302, so what you want to do is click Control on both of these. And once you click Control, you're going to drag these over to Removable Disk F, which is going to be your thumb drive. So again, you want these two files unzipped out of the zip separately like they are now. And you want to drag these two into the Removable Disk F, which will load to your thumb drive, which is what we're going to use in order to uh, download the code into the, the pinball machine. So let's move towards the next step. So as you can see, we are now downloading uh, the code into the removable F disk drive, which as it says, SAN disk. That is the SAN disk thumb drive. Everything matches up. Copying two items, 2.15 gigabytes. So of course, if you have a two or under a gigabyte thumb drive, it will not work. You need a bigger one. And of course, it shows you the minutes here, 14 minutes on my computer for this to download. Of course, I don't have the greatest internet being in the country. So anyway, let's go ahead and move on to the next point of our steps. Next step of the process is to go ahead and get ready to get your thumb drive and download it into the USB on the back of the Spike 2 and uh, Ninja Turtle. So what we're gonna do next is unlock right here, pull the front of the face down, pull the trans light out, and then we will, uh, we will go ahead and plug in our thumb drive from there. Now that we got the front of the, the face of the, the back box and the trans light out on obviously Spike 2 newer games, you're gonna have two USB thumb uh, ports right here. I'm gonna go ahead and pick the left one to go ahead and put my thumb drive in. Next part of this is basically turning on the pinball machine. Uh, currently it is off and we're gonna go ahead and start it up. And as you can see here, now that we've started this up, we went ahead and flipped the bottom down up and game code, it says Turtles Pro 1.23. That shows that the code actually went to the thumb drive uh, and is working. So of course uh, you have your press you know, negative, positive to choose, press select to update, press back to exit. So what we wanna do is come down here into the door and we're gonna hit the black button here. And it says select update options, update quick, verify no, press X, you know, positive, negative. What we're gonna do again is just go ahead and click the black button. So what it's gonna do is it's gonna go ahead and update the code pretty simply here. So with that uh, said, it will take probably about, eh, probably about five minutes or so while it's unpacking the files and we will return back to get this, th this game up and running. And so now, as you can see with uh, the machine finally going through its cycle, uh, it's basically going through updating to version 1.23. It did go through a 
update node board shows the node board not being found on there, which it is now. It's saying locating node boards one, eight, and nine. And uh, of course, with this, it kind of cycles out of it. Uh, but other than that, now we're good. And again, don't worry about it. If you see the node board update on there, it sometimes takes a second, so don't freak out. Uh, just let it run, let it sit for a second, and what it will do is it will actually restart itself again, and generally it could cycle maybe one or two times. So do not freak out there. And what will end up happening, as you just saw, it said locate no boards uh, on the display. It went through one cycle. Now we're on the second cycle at this point, and then the code finally updated into the machine at this point. So everything is good to go. But anyway, that's pretty much all there is to updating a Stern pinball machine. Uh, if you have any questions, please put it down below the video. I'll be more than happy to walk you through this and to help you. Uh, but beyond that, thank you for watching today. Please click subscribe. Help our channel. Uh, we are a non-biased channel, uh, not sponsored or anything. So obviously sharing and subscribing uh, would help us tremendously. But beyond that, thank you again for watching. And until next time, this is your Neighborhood Arcade and Pinball Talk Guy, signing off.